Good morning, future dentists. Can anyone guess where we're snapping from today? No, we're not snapping from India today. We are, in fact, snapping from the greatest city in the world, London. My name is Vinay, I'm a fourth year dental student, and I'll be showing you what dentistry is like in the UK. So right now I'm in West London. I'll just take this red line all the way past Oxford Circus, all the way up to Whitechapel. So we're here with the only white person studying here, and her name is Victoria. Do you enjoy dentistry? I love dentistry. Well, here we are at Clarkson London, the School of Medicine and Dentistry. We are, of course, the world's best dental school. Are we not year four? I have a feeling that I need to get out of my room a bit more and experience real life a little bit more. And so I'm going to take a big punch out of this advert from years ago. When I came in, this was beautiful sunshine out in the mean streets of Whitechapel. Why is that? Hello, future dentist. Hello. Uh, my name's Ryan, I'm a fifth year dentist at Bart's the London School of Medicine. Probably the cleverest guy I know, but Ryan, how do you get into dentistry? Uh, well, in Britain, uh, you can go into dentistry straight out of school. Um, and most people choose to do it this way, but you can also uh, do it after you've done another degree, so three years before, and then you come into dentistry as a graduate. And Ryan, how much does dentistry cost in the UK? Uh, for most people, it's £9,000 a year, but for me, because I'm from Wales, it costs me £3,500 a year. So, um, in Britain, it's five years long, and uh, we start by doing basic clinical sciences. Then, in the second year, we go on to cutting our first teeth, and then at the end of that year, we see our first patients for screenings. Uh, in third, fourth, and fifth year, then we start doing more complex treatments such as extraction, root canals, crown and bridge, and also denture work. So, uh, in the final year, around November, you apply for your first jobs, which is called uh, dental foundation training, and that's what I'm about to do now. Hey, Mr. C, say hello. Hello there, uh, Dental Land. We're going to give some dental instructions to uh, one of our best special trays. And we're going to trim around about the periphery of the tray okay. and make sure that it's about two to three millimeters short of the sulcus depth. We're going to do like an outtake as well. <laughs> <laughs> what do you think, Tosin? Yeah, I agree. <laughs> what are you doing? Um, wax. Wax? <laughs> wow. Have you got any advice for anyone wanting to pursue a career in Max Sucks? Um, yes. 
So, and uh, sometimes the people aren't quite as pleasant as you'd like. Most times they are. Um, but you, um, um, then you're you, you're in an incredibly privileged position. There is nothing better that a human being can do than doing something. So I'm with my, with my friend Ruhaid, he's a medic, we don't really talk to him but yeah. Today is a club day or society day. think of uh, the junior doctors strike? Basically, for everyone out there who's a junior doctor, just pray that nothing bad happens to you. Join Women's Hockey. We're in the BLSA building on the ground floor. Oh, brilliant! Hi, this is Scott Surgical Society. Come to the old library and sign up. We run events throughout the year, and we're running a laparoscopic competition today as well. Hope to see wow. you. Hello, gents around the world. We're here in central London Whitechapel, promoting our rowing club. Of many BL dentists signing up. Hope you're having a good day wherever you are. Men's hockey is the best society because although it's got a professional body, we do the best money. socials. We do the best socials. We do the dental dinner. Yeah. Do you get free toothpaste? You get you get shitloads of free toothpaste. Infectious diseases. Right, so we are part of Infectious Diseases Society and we're brand new to the society this, um, this year. We're going to have to be running movie nights. Um, this year we're going to play Outbreak, Contagion, maybe 28 days later. So if you're interested, um, come along. You can also win a So I'm with Anne from the Teddy Bear Hospital and she's going to tell us a little bit about what they do. Hey guys, so I'm talking about Tabor Hospital here. So Tabor Hospital is an organisation that we volunteer with kids, with medical and dental students to teach kids. And we teach kids how not to be scared of doctors and dentists and we teach them good healthy habits that last them a lifetime. in dentistry? Looking forward to in dentistry? Everything! <laughs> okay! So that was a first year student and uh, what about a uh, fourth year student? And a fifth year student! <laughs> What do you think of dentists? Um, they take too much time to train. Oh, oh, no! <laughs> what do you think of dentists? They're cool, they play with teeth, and they make a big difference. My friend. What do you think of dentists? <laughs> What do you think of dentists? Um, I think they're quite intelligent, but actually I think medics might be a little bit better. So come back to the today. I'm a freshman, have you got any advice for first year? Don't look at me, I'm a freshman. Run for your life. <laughs> Thank you.
All right, guys, we're about to see all the sports societies. It could get a bit messy. <laughs> He's ready, ready to go. Let's go, baby. Oh. So who are you guys? We are from MSF. A lot better than baseball because in cricket the ball gets out of the park regularly. In baseball, in uh, baseball you might only get 10 runs a game. In cricket you probably get 300. So it's got to be a better sport. <laughs> So the library at Bart is actually a church. Check it out. So loads and loads and loads of you have been messaging me about how much does dentistry cost in the UK? It only costs £9,000, saying it costs about $80,000 in America if you go to a private school. That £9,000 that we pay, the government give every student the opportunity to have a loan. And it's a really, really cheap loan. That means if you're poor, if you're rich, it doesn't matter. Everyone can attend dental or medical school. World, my name is Vinay, and welcome to part two of Future Dentists, and welcome back to London. Today we're going to the seaside. Uh, we're going to an outreach clinic in Southend on Sea. It's about two and a half hours away, so that's a hell of. A Come on, I don't know. <laughs> so this is my bay for the year. Oh. Oh yeah, yours is nice. All black everything. Oh. The very big news today, which I'm going to dentistry in the UK, is on this website. 
want to apply to dental school in the UK, as my friend just said, go to www.ucas.com and you can find all the information in the UK. You can also find a lot of information on the website I'm about to post. For all you postgrads that have completed BDS, completed your undergraduate degree and want to do another degree afterwards in the UK, check out this website. So future dentists, sadly this is the end from us at London, but it's blah! <laughs> no, but in all seriousness, I really hope you've enjoyed all the snaps about dentistry in London. If you have any questions, feel free to keep in touch.